It's 11 o'clock. We just got into a room. Daniel's been vomiting since yesterday. We're at Danbury Hospital. And here he is, just plopped in. Waiting. See, see what mommy looks like. Not too bad considering exhausted and sick, but at least I got my medicine yesterday, so that's already helping. Um, so we're just waiting, right? Say hi. Hi, friends. I know. He feels miserable. Hey. A bumper car is perfect. Let's build a park. Thank you for the lovely turkey wrap. John brought me lunch. Hi, John. Hello. It's the benefit of being in Danbury. Yeah. You would have been eating down at the cafeteria if you're at Yale. You like Daddy's hair? You know, nice and short. It's fuzzy. And he's acting more like himself right now. Yeah. He was so weak when I was driving him over here. I was nervous. Well, yeah. We half a bag. How many cc's in? 300 cc's in? So we're on bag number two. IV fluids. Over there. Just trying to get his fluids up. And um, he seemed to be feeling better for a few minutes. And he was all happy and smiley. When Daddy came to visit at lunchtime, and then now he's kind of pooped out again. I wish he would fall asleep, but very stimulating in here. Hi, huh, Dad. Yeah, he's doing okay. What time is it now? Let's see. Clocked in eleven. It's now. Quarter of two. Open in the emergency room. It's like the time just goes and goes and goes. Why are you twitching? You just twitched. You okay? A sicky face. It's like a ghost town. It's like a horror movie. Do 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 do. Do huh. you just had an ultrasound? Didn't you? What the? Well, it's 9, 10 p.m. We are admitted and resting. He's uh, still having fluids tonight because he is still a little retchy. His sodium was high, so they took more blood to test it. And... Um, they just want to watch and make sure he's okay. Mm. You okay? He's still a little nauseous, but he seems to be a little bit more like himself, right? Not like you were last night, man. Woof. I'm on the 11th floor of Danbury Hospital. Used to be at Yale, but nah, this is different. We just had visitors from Grandma and Papa live near here, so they came to visit us. And we had a nice chat. And for a nice change, I actually get to use an actual bed. Wow. Because I don't know if any of you guys have ever stayed in a hospital, but a lot of times what they do is the child is in bed and they will provide mom with a place to sleep, but usually it's like this vinyl fold-out sofa bed couch thingy that turns into some kind of a bed. You put a sheet on it, and it's the most uncomfortable thing in the world. <coughs> but considering that I'm sick, and he's sick, and we probably have the same sick, 
Um, it's going to feel good to sleep, so we'll see if I do. This has been quite a journey. Um, it's peaceful. It's the hospital where they were born, so it's like coming home again. So funny. We don't come here very often anymore. All right, my little boy. Hang in there. You are amazing. <laughs>